pleasant good morning to you. The Bible text says in Galatians chapter 6 and verse 2, bear ye one another's burdens, and so fulfill the love of Christ. Listen, when something happens to you and you get a chance to talk to somebody about it, somebody totally unrelated to what happened, and they give a listening ear to what is happening to you. It helps. We as human beings, uh, listen, we as human beings, God created us as social beings, connected with each other, whether it is within families or within communities. Uh, talking with others will help you. Uh, it may be a friend you choose to talk with. It may be a relative. No man stands alone. No man is an island. After you have spoken with somebody about a situation, if even the person has not offered suggestions as to how to help to get you out of that situation, it helps. So we come back to the text. Christians, within our various congregations. Listen, when you go to church, whether it is Sunday or Saturday or night meetings, remember, somebody wants to pour out to you, listen to them. That may be the difference between a good night's sleep for that individual or whether they toss and turn or get up and watching TV, watching games right through the night because they cannot sleep. So remember the text, Galatians chapter 6 and verse 2, which says, Bear ye one another's body, and so fulfill the law of Christ. Never you think that, listen, are you okay? I can bear all by myself. Is not one human being even that God created and put on the face of this earth. You know, over the weekend something happened. And I'm running in my head. How this happened? And then a close relative of mine called. And I told my wife, who is they? She said, I said, give me the phone. And me and this individual spoke about this situation and about many other things. And just by doing that, listen, my head was clear. And listen, you see, I'm talking about myself now. And you hear the effect. Speaking to another person help. Well, listen, similarly, I need to make myself available from time to time to let somebody who has a severe problem be allowed to pour out to me. Let us be in the habit of bearing one another's burden. It will lengthen the life of somebody. God and Father, thanks so much for your goodness, <coughs> grace and mercy. Guide us as we go through the day and help us to bear one another's burden. In Jesus' name I thank I'm the fount of every blessing. Tune my heart to sing thy grace. Streams of mercy never ceasing. Call for songs of loudest praise.